What is up guys? Welcome back to our channel. Today I'm doing my 34 week update. I'm actually 35 weeks now. Um, but I'm going to give you guys an update on the last week and how I was feeling. First things first, um, I want to apologize for not uploading on Thursday. The reason we didn't upload is because we're obviously now moved into our new place. I'm actually in the boys' nursery right now, which, as you can tell, is not done. But that means the nursery tour is coming very soon because we're on a bit of a time crunch here. Anyways, so the last week, how I've been feeling. I'm going to kind of keep this one a little short because it's a one-week update and... As you can see, I've got a lot of stuff to do. But anyways, um, how I've been feeling this last week, huge is the easiest way to put it. I'm huge. Getting out of the house and stuff has actually been hard for quite some time now. However, it's getting to the point now where it's almost unbearable to be at like stores and stuff like that. Um, I was almost in tears walking around Walmart the other day just because it's so, so painful. Especially like down here, my lower stomach, I feel like is bearing most of the weight. Surprisingly, it's not my back that I'm feeling most of my pain. It's the lower stomach and my knees. So that has been my life situation. Um, I'm not sure if this is related 100% to my pregnancy, but I've been super, super, super congested lately. Um, like, really bad. Heartburn is still taking over my life. I never thought it could get worse than it was a couple months ago, but let me tell you, it has been continuing to get worse. I actually switched off Zantac, and my doctor had me switch to Pepsid AC. Um, I believe just because my body was kind of getting used to the Zantac because I took it so regularly It was time to switch it up and find something that worked a little better. The Pepsid it seems to be working better Longer so it doesn't feel like it's as effective as the Zantac, but it is lasting longer without being as intense. I Don't know if that makes sense, but That's the best way I can put it we actually went out yesterday and bought the boys cribs and stuff super excited the rest of our home stuff is not going to be here till august 8th which is super 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 pushing it for when the boys are going to be here my latest date um, as most of you know already is august 20th so Hopefully they stay in until like August 10th <laughs> um, so we can get our stuff done. I don't really have much for new symptoms, honestly, other than just getting more uncomfortable. More pain, getting bigger, the works. I've actually kind of, I don't really know if this is a symptom, but I've actually kind of been feeling numb. So my stomach... I don't really feel the boys move much. I have to like actually see them moving. I mean, if they do their big movements and stuff, I obviously feel it because it's painful, it's life. But um, I pretty much have to see them moving to feel it. My stomach is super numb. Um, I think just because my skin has stretched so much. Um, my doctor also said that I'm having uh, contractions, like inconsistent contractions, of course, but I can't feel them. So I guess that's kind of a negative positive, but yeah, I don't feel any of them at all, but he says I am having them. Definitely also starting to feel a little bit more stressed out about them getting here. I think it's mostly just because we have so much to do at the new place. Um, and then we have, I mean, just a short amount of time to get all of it done. So it's extra stressful, plus all the emotions of pregnancy and getting close to the end and all that fun stuff but we're out here striving surviving all the fun stuff um but yeah that's pretty much it not a whole lot has changed um again i do want to apologize for not uploading on thursday we will make up for it this thursday this thursday's video is a little bit more exciting um yeah but thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions leave them down below we'll be happy to answer them
Don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button so you never miss a video, never miss an update. We love you guys so much.